Gotta real quick, just gotta kill him. Just gotta punch him in the, gotta punch him in the tooth. Just gotta punch him in the. All right, that's was fucking bullshit. Hey everybody, college graduate here, coming at you with another educational video. Today I'm gonna teach you how to play AP Recon, a build that I invented myself. Now, first of all, fuck you. Don't question mark me. This shit's hard, man. And second of all, it's probably the thing that's most important is that fuck you. I did invent this. I swear to God, man, I've been playing AP Recon since 400 BC with my friend Julius. Caesar of the Roman Empire, but now it's just a thing. Oh, it's just a thing everyone does now. Oh, wow, look at me, AP Recon. Oh, haha, ha, wow. No! I invented this, okay? I did it first. Nobody thought of playing Recon AP before I did. Nobody thought of that shit. Nobody thought of that shit! I invented AP Recon, okay? Don't think it was anyone else, because it was me. Also, I invented the iPhone. No one believes me, but it's true. Look at it. Look at the drawings, guys. Look at this shit. Fuck you, Bill Gates, you fucking piece of shit! <clears throat> um, I may have gone a bit overboard with that, but maybe we should just move on and accept that I did invent this, because I did, and that's the truth. Alright? Okay, now guys, as I am the sole inventor of AP Recon, as we just established, I understand that you all might have some questions for me. You all must think I'm a genius, and I personally am willing to accept that responsibility. However, as the genius who invented this build, I do feel obligated to teach you guys how to play it. AP Recon's one of the best things in the game, man. Fucking piece of shit, Yasuo! It is one of the best things to ever be added to League of Legends, and I personally have been an advocate for it for as long as I can remember. Especially since they kill scales with your AP, and you're probably not gonna build any. You know, unless you're Dark Main. I, it's, it's so, it's one of the worst things I've tried. This is obviously Photoshop propaganda designed to make me look foolish. Don't let the liberals trick you, kids. Look, guys, it's obvious that AP Recon is the best thing in the world because it was invented by a genius like me, so it has to be. I did invent it, by the way, just to make things clear. So now, to teach you how to play AP Recon, let's move on to Recon's moves. Behold, Recon's passive gives him a shield. That's basically it, actually. That's the whole thing. His Q throws a feather that heals him after three hours. His W is a dashing knockup. His E is a dashing dash. And let's just say that when you use his ult, you might as well be a paper towel because you're charming ultra strong. <laughs> A uh, big shout out to Margaret for that joke, it's uh, very good. Well, I guess that's it. I guess that's all of uh, Rakan's moves, I suppose. I guess I just said them all. Uh, there certainly isn't some secret hidden thing that I'm purposely leaving out so I can interject it right here. You know, uh, certainly none of those. Oh well, I guess there really isn't anything. But wait, there's more! Unbeknownst to the general public, Rakan actually has a second secret passive. The reason nobody else knows about this is because you actually have to have an over 400 IQ to unlock it, so I'm actually the only person in the world who's smart enough to- Rakan's secret passive is I'm fucking Rakan, a move that tricks the enemy's mind. Here, we can see it in action. As you can see, this Yasuo's getting really cocky, he's killed me like 15 million times, so he thinks he can kill me again when the reality is- <laughs> <laughs> These types of kills make up about 90% of every kill I've gotten in League of Legends. Hi everybody. 
This one goes out to all my homies out there who have a below 500 IQ, who keep trying to kill me and fail hilariously. I wish you'd stop trying to kill me, my friend. You could not die, you fucking guy, when you fight me. And if you underestimate my power, I would understand. I would understand. An angry swain's gonna get got once he takes five tower shots. I'll just ignite him real quick. Then this Yasuo tries to kill me, but he's a goddamn chimpanzee! Fuck you, you cocky dick! Well, everyone I know has got a reason to say, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill, kill myself, myself today. today! I wish you'd stop trying to kill me, my friend. You could not die, you fucking guy, when you fight me. And if you underestimate my power, I would understand. I would understand. I will grow 500 feet tall. I will rampage through New York City. I'm an eldritch god trapped in a man's body. I would understand. I would understand. Ah, shit! Fuck! God damn it, you son of a bitch! Look, guys, I'm not trying to act like I'm superior to anybody. Because I am. I don't have to act. It's just true, so... Hey, folks, and welcome to Dark Man's How to Attract Women Guide, starring AP Recon Inventor, 600 IQ Possessor, Special Boy, Dark Man. Me. Now, fellas, are you having lady problems? Do you not know how to interact with women? Well, you came to the right place, because me neither. So now, I will teach you my patented techniques on how to attract a woman. Now, guys, I am the master of romance, all right? I have a 700 IQ. I know how women work, all right? You know what I'm saying, fellas? You know, women, they're all the same, all right, guys? <laughs> am I right or am I right, guys? You know what I'm saying? You know, am I right? Uh, to all the women watching, please don't stop watching. It's only joking. You're all very unique and amazing. Please don't click off this. This is how I make a living. Anywho, here we are. We see a beautiful woman. What do we do? You know, how do we get the ball rolling? Well, let me tell you, it's all about how you approach the situation, all right? See, look at this. You see, I just come up to her, I just go, ha! You know, I just go, I just go, I just go. Just go, whoo, you know what I'm saying? Just gotta go over here and say, whoo, you know what I'm saying? Just gotta, just gotta do one of those, just gotta get her. You just gotta, just gotta get her real quick. Just gotta get her, and you just gotta get her like that, you know? Just gotta get her, and... <laughs> uh, now, I feel like this might be a little bit misleading. Uh, I feel like it might seem like I'm trying to say you just gotta hit the woman until she tries to run away. Um, don't do that. Seriously, don't tell people I told you to do that. For real, don't. Please don't. You see, guys, it's not a literal representation, alright? Each slap represents, uh, praise. I don't want to hurt this woman. I certainly don't want to kill her. Uh, shit. Of course, the main problem, if you kill her, moral issues aside, is that when you do that, Master Yi is gonna come for you, and he's, he's really good, so he's just gonna go ahead and get you, and he's gonna just keep trying to kill you, even if you flash away, he's just gonna kill you under tower, dude, and he's gonna get away with it too, that's why we call him the Master. And just to elaborate on my previous point, as I was saying earlier, each slap represents praise, alright? So you see a hitter with the, how's your day been? You look great today, I will support your goals. And then, wait, here it comes, alright, here comes the bombshell, alright, here it is. Now, once again, you gotta keep in mind that after you kill her, Master Yi will come for you because he thirsts for blood. And he will get you under the tower, even if you try to get away, once again, because he is so good, that is why we call him the Master. This stuff ain't working for you, man. Just get a friend in there, you know? Just get a, just get a friend in there, beat the crap out of her together, you know? Just beat the crap out of her. It, it, it's all metaphorical, once again. I just want to make it clear that it's metaphorical. Please don't misconstrue. Come down here and kill the person next to her to show off that you are indeed a genius with an 800 IQ. That's really gonna impressor. Then, you have to, uh, kill Teemo. Uh, no reason, it's just very recommended. And this part right here demonstrates that they will never escape, and that no matter how hard they try to run away, they will always be under my control. 
metaphorically. It's it's just it's a metaphor. All right, I just want to make it clear. Please understand, it's just a metaphor. Then right here, you just want to go ahead and you just want to just want to get her, and then you just want to you want to just take a lap. You know, take a lap. Scream it to the world that you've killed this lady, and just take a lap around the thing. Uh, you know, just like that, and then you just walk by here. And what the fuck are you looking at? <laughs> uh. Metaphorically. And then we win the game just like that. Now, fellas, what did we learn from this? Nothing. You know, guys, it gets lonely sometimes. Being the smartest person in the world. An IQ of 900, you know, that is just really, really smart. And you know, the problem is not only am I surrounded by these idiots that I can kill so quickly, but also, I have yet to find a worthy adversary. Even my more formidable opponents have all fallen to me. For example, look at this guy. This man is a stealth master. But even him, I was able to kill so easily because of how smart I am. Even this Shaco, you know, he tries to use his moves on me, but I don't even need to see him to kill him. And I just kill him so quickly because I'm a genius. And this Yasuo, who fought so valiantly for his life, but in the end just could not stand a chance against a 1000 IQ man like me. No! But I guess in the end, that's just how it is. The life of a 2000 IQ man is a lonely one. But I guess that's just the price someone like me has to pay in order to possess this gift. This is AP Recon Inventor, 1 million IQ Possessor, Dark Mane, here to tell you that that's just what it takes to have a 2 million IQ. Look at this. Look at this, Shaco. What does he think he's gonna do? He's just gonna get knocked up and then he's gonna. <gasps> Dear God. Did you see that? Oh my god! He waited for just the right moment and then he just did his BAM! You know? Oh my god, I've never seen calculations so precise! That was amazing! This man is the smartest man in the world! He will usher in a new era for mankind! He will be the catalyst for the evolution of humanity! I must add this man and discover the secrets that are buried within his mind! Oh great one, please bestow upon us the awesome knowledge that lies hidden within your enigmatic brain! What the fuck?